Hey guys, Ben here. Um, I'm absolutely disgusted. Uh, I know that's kind of a harsh way of starting this video off, but it's the truth. I'm, I'm disgusted uh, with people in this community. Um, it's it's a community of crybabies at this point. Crybabies and bullies, I guess, is really the only two kind of people that are actually in this community at this point. It's sad. It's sad and ridiculous that this is going on um, where people are asking for shout outs and when the person says no, they throw a fit and start posting lies about you. Um, putting people down, putting kids down that are just starting out, telling people that they're, you know, retarded and to kill themselves, especially telling kids to kill themselves and saying bad things about their parents and their families and stuff. It's just not right, and it needs to stop. I'd say this is the fourth video that I've made about this, and I can't post any of them, and I'm hoping that this is the one that's going to get posted. If you're watching it, it's the one. I'm disgusted. I'm saddened and disgusted by the things that are being said nowadays. It's ridiculous. The people with the big egos that think they run this community, you don't. Get off your high horse and realize where you are and what you're meant to be doing in this community and equal with everybody else. There's nobody here that's better than anybody else. There's nobody here that's worse than anybody else. Well, actually, no, there is people. Not everybody's equal in my mind. I think the people that are putting everybody else down, they're not equal. They're jerks. They're low lowlifes. They got nothing better to do. But to put people down, I, I'd i like a life that was so laid back and I had nothing to do. I had that little to do that all I could do was pick on kids. Because they have to have nothing to do in their lives to have that, to do that. It's sad. It's ridiculous. That we have to, that everybody has to go through this. It's my model. I paid for it. If I want to paint it pink and put sparklies on it, I can do that. Because guess what? I paid for it. No matter if it in your eyes it's ruining the model or not. It could be a $6,000 model that I pulled that $6,000 out of my bank account to buy. And I want to put a thumb on it. I damn right put a thumb on it. It doesn't matter. The whole thing about thumbs are for pricks. Get over yourselves. If I want to put a thumb on a model, I put a thumb on a model. It's my model. I don't think people understand the difference between their model and somebody else's model because it's quite sad when a 15-year-old has to explain this to some of these older adults. Now, I've known a bunch of people in this community for quite some time. Um, Diecast Mania. I just got to meet him the other day. A shy kid, but what? a smart person about these models. He knows everything. He can point out this one little detail that's missing on one model from a mile away. What a great kid. What a nice kid. What an honest kid. We do a deal the other day. He counted out my money four times just to make sure he had the proper amount. So he so he wasn't to rip me off. He wasn't to give me the wrong amount. He kept counting it and counting it and counting it. And me and Kevin gave him a little shit for it. But you know what? We were just joking around, and he knew we were just joking around. Kevin, what a great guy. One of the only last people that I look up to in this community still. He He's seen me grow. He's known me since the beginning. He understands where I came from and what I've become, and I greatly appreciate that. Kevin, great kid. Talk to him all the time. We we go through some we went through some rough patches, but you know what? He's a good person. I like him. He's a nice kid. Um those three are the last people that I actually have hope for this community with that have been here since the beginning. I'm pretty sure that it's me, Kevin, Joe, Cat Mac three sixteen that are the only ones that are still here that have been on YouTube since the since way back in two thousand seven, two thousand eight. There are more people like Keith that I, I, I just love as people because they're so nice to the kids. 
and they understand where the kids are coming from and that maybe these kids don't have all the time of the day they don't have everything you know just it's it's just it's very you know I don't know how to describe it but it's uh it's sad what these guys are doing how they're putting these other kids down how they're Constantly tormenting other people just for the enjoyment of themselves. Um, I, I'm I'm disappointed in a lot of people. Um, people throwing hissy fits because somebody won't give them a shout out. People calling other people scammers because they do, don't want to ship first. Um, just stuff that shouldn't be going on is going on right now. and It's really sad. And um, especially putting kids down about their models and... I was this close to quitting. I was this close to quitting, and I even did it. I stopped for a few days. Um, but I came back because I realized that people do want to see my stuff, and people want to interact with me. So I came back, and I've been here since, and I don't think I'm leaving again. Maybe if stuff goes really out of hand, I'll leave, and I'll just I'll make another page and just talk to the people that I know personally. Um, because there are a lot of people I know personally that I, I know I can trust. But as Kevin Rollins brought up, Tommy's diecast threatened a kid, told him he should commit suicide. 3JS diecast threatened to, said that he wanted people to commit suicide. Kids. One of them being me. That's not okay. I know Kevin saw it. I know Kevin commented on it. Making jokes about autistic people. That's not okay. None of this stuff is okay. You gotta think about it before you post it. Because it's just ridiculous when there has to be a 15 year old telling a 34 year old how to act in a community. Because they're not acting like it's a community. They don't run the community. Nobody runs the community. We're all one big community. A community is a bunch of people that have common interests. Not a group of people run by one person because they think they're better than the rest of them. You want to do that? We're not. We're. we're we don't have. We don't want a dictator. We want to have a community where people can just talk about what they want. They can post pictures of their equipment. They can post pictures of their models, and that's it. We don't need this drama. The drama stops. There's enough drama in real life, in school, in work, that we don't need more drama when we get home to try to relax and show off our models. So you know what? The next, and I'm, I, I am a, I am a victim of this, and I'm also, I've also done this myself with the big ego. Get over yourselves. I'm gonna say it really quickly. Get over yourselves. You know what's really weird? I just noticed that. See how those wipers are going? These wipers are going the exact opposite way. You can see them. Those are going like that. And those are going that way. And those are going that way. So that's kind of weird. Oh, look at this. These are going the other way too. Huh. Depends on which model you get, I guess. But um, that's it, guys. I'm just going to gonna end this video. Um, if, if, if you still want to create drama, do it somewhere else. Don't do it in this community. This community has enough problems that we don't need your issues either. And if you're going to quit, just don't. Unless if you're a jerk. If, if you're a good person, don't quit. Just because some haters are saying stuff about you. Don't quit. Because there, there was a whole group created just solely about how much people hate me. And I laughed about it, brushed it off, and moved on with my day. But I want to thank Kevin Rollins. And CatMac316 Kevin for finally putting opinion out there and giving some other people the guts to put out a video explaining what's going on. I know this, the, all these videos are basically the same, stating the exact same things. But you know what, guys? There has to be a change. We're going to make this model community great again. We're going to make model collecting great again. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions... Be, feel free to comment below if you want to unsubscribe, good. Oh, yeah, and here's the that's the other thing. Just because you have more followers doesn't mean that you're better than anybody else. <coughs> Diecast construction expert. <coughs> no, I'm just kidding, Kale. I love you, bud. All right, thank you guys for watching. Um, go and follow Kale because he has too many followers. Um, and, um, yeah. 
But again, no, just because you have more followers doesn't make you better than anybody else. And that's why I appreciate Kale, because he doesn't think he's better than anybody else. And this goes for 164th Community, too. I'm not going to make a separate video. I've been asked to make a separate video, but I'm not going to, just because these rules apply to the same thing. I'm pretty sure that me, Kevin, Joe, and Catmac316, Kevin, are going to make a video soon about rules and guidelines that should be made that we're going to make for this community just so that we have a better community there need to be rules placed there needs to be there needs to be a boundary set that if you cross it you're going to you know you're going to be shunned you're going to be blocked by everybody and that's the end of that so thank you guys for watching and uh, have a nice night have a good week and um i will hopefully be getting back into videos if you notice i was on a hiatus for a while just because of how bad the community was so thank you guys for watching and i just realized there's a step on the tg7000 all right bye guys